ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, my name's Benson. What's yours? Uh, we are across the street from this place. And I don't know if you can see it right there. That brown looking thing is a Bushes baked beans can. And we are at the Bushes Family Cafe slash museum. Uh, I've seen this place a couple times. Uh, coming through Tennessee, and I was like, I want to stop. We gotta go see this place. I mean, I don't even eat bushes, make beans. Maybe once every blue moon, maybe. But I just thought we'd go check it out. Uh, yeah, it's like a, it's a saying like once in a very long time. Oh. Let's go check it out. Yeah. Bushes best. Do you know the Bushes family recipe? The dog does. So I guess they have, so they have the family cafe here and then they have a general store slash museum. So I don't know if we're going to eat here. I know the kids are hungry, but we'll see. We're definitely going to hit out the museum and stuff. But that's the actual plants over there. There's a giant bean can right there. A manger scene. I don't even know what they serve. They are open till 3 p.m. Hello. I'm a part of the scene. <laughs> well, they got an old truck out here. It's cool. You can see the can of beans now better. It's a part of the scene. It's a terrible part of scenery. They're Christmas decorations. little photo opportunity, a little wooden door arch there. That's cool. I have no idea what we're going to see when we get in here. Ate <laughs> some beans? <laughs> Go wait, Scoo. Be the plant that's across the street. Oh, okay. So the Bush is home place. See the light? The AJ Bush Company General Store. The light. This is the Bush Brothers State of the Art facility. That's cool. What is that? Chestnut Hill United something church. Okay. The, the Bush home place. That's, that's where they live. Hang on. So that's the ambulance station. Chestnut Hill Fire Department. What's it called? The Community Park and Picnic Pavilion. So we're like right here. School building. Okay. Corporation. Over there? Cool. They have their own action figures. That's kind of neat. That's funny. The Bushes Bean action figure commercial aired in early 2013 and featured Jay and Duke action figures. These figures actually do talk, saying some of the lines. Duke has taken quite a shine to them and thinks they would make great gifts for Duke bean lovers <laughs> that's funny I didn't realize they made a commercial for it they do have a movie that shows but their last one's already started so it shows the whole processing part of it so like the beans come in they get cooked So, beans are really earth-friendly crop. They naturally return nitrogen back to the soil. Nitrogen is a main ingredient used for plant growth and takes a lot of energy to make nitrogen-based fertilizer. Beans make their own nitrogen through symbiosis with soil micro microorganisms. A field of beans uses about half the fossil energy as most other crops. 
Additionally, they require less pesticides, herbicides, chemical fertilizers, and water than any major crop. They dry naturally, so you don't require more energy to dry them. That's cool. I didn't realize they just let them dry on the vine. The importance of healthy pulse. Did you know peas, beans, lentils, and chickpeas, known as pulses, are the dried seeds of plants belonging to the legume family? Well, they are. Why is it important? Pulses are one of the most sustainable sources of protein in the world, according to many scientists and, nutri and nutritionists. Pulse crops will be a big part of the solution to how our planet can, sus can sustainably feed the anticipated population of 9 billion people in the next 50 years. Did you know that most steel cans are recyclable? So you can actually recycle. Recycle Recycling steel food cans save 74% of the total energy needed to produce steel from scratch. Our new ch facility just across the street uses less water than our former facility and most of that water is recycled either through production process or returned back to the land through spray irrigation. At, Bush's, at Bush Brothers, we take pride in serving our Serving you our very best beans. That's why we take such care in preparing them in a way that's responsible and reliable. Pretty cool. Pretty neat. So the process. The beans dry. Then they soak. Then they go into a mix. Then they get the secret family recipe. Then they can them, ship them out, and you eat them. It's a gorgeous tree. I like that. It's the Bush's General Store over here. The Chesney Hill Methodist Church. Duke's house. I'm assuming that's a bean vine? You can find out your weight in beans, so it calculates your weight and then tells you how many beans that is. James weighs 216,576 beans. <laughs> you can get a free souvenir photo over here uh, for coming to the beans thing. AJ and Sally Bush. He was a man with ambition, vision, and determination to improve the living conditions of his family and others in the community where he lived. He believed quality was the best policy and that honesty and integrity were essential to a successful business. He built that kind of character into the business and instilled these principles in those he trained to follow him. He was great at developing character, imagination, and desire to succeed and a willingness to give the job his best in all who worked for or with him. I think I can still feel his strong character which made a person want to accomplish something and take pride in the work he was doing. Claude Bush. Can you estimate how many pages are in the book? A lot. Seems like a good estimation. Not a number. So it's just them and, them and their kids. This is our original office chair. This is a fireless cook stove. So it's AJ Bush and Company, so it probably doesn't look like they started out necessarily just doing, just selling beans. There's other stuff they sold here too. So this is a 1906 sales flyer. Uh, it shows promotion of the early 1900s. The language is quaint by today's standards. It's a canner. It seemed the can. What is this used for? Seam, putting a seam on the can, closing the can. 
says the earliest cans were soldered closed by hand. These are 100 year old soldered cans. What was this used for? To solder the can closed. What does that mean? Heat the metal so it closed itself. It's a giant steamer. There are can openers throughout the years, so the bull's head, which basically looks like a mini axe. Uh, they added a bottle opener to the axe. It's an 1890 Schofield. This is from 1935. The adjustable from 1900. The rotating wheel style. This one wasn't invented until 1925. And then the electric can opener was invented in 1950. This is, this is a 1970s Chestnut Hill plant uniform. It's pretty cool. This company's got a huge long history. It's pretty neat that they have this whole little history set up. And there's Duke. We a said free souvenir photo. Two of them. Yeah. This is a bedspread made for Francis Bush, donated by Betty Workman. There is a flying pig. <laughs> recipe for sale. <laughs> Secret family recipe for sale. Plates and stuff. And then here's the Bush Bush Secret Family Recipe book. BMP view. This book contains the recipe for Bush's baked beans. Don't get too close or you might trigger the invisible laser security system. The recipe of brown sugar, specially cured bacon, and a secret blend of spices was created by Kathleen Bush and passed down for generations. Today, Jay Bush is the keeper of the family secret and his best friend Duke, also known also knows the recipe, but Jay trusts him not to tell anyone. It's cool. Good. It's a quilt made by Sally Bush's mother. And then we're back in the gift shop in case we want some beans. There are all kinds of stuff in here. Like country living style, like knickknacks and stuff. They're kind of cool. What do you think of the Bush's store and museum? I think beans. <laughs> It was cute. It's neat to see their history. See bean, think bean. Yeah. yeah. I, see I mean, bean. from as close as I can from this side. We got some. We got some things. Beans mostly. Candy too. One pound exactly. Cafe. Yeah. Maybe we can make it to the cafe before we leave tomorrow. I see a bean. I think a bean. You are a bean. I is a bean. <laughs> Anyways, we're back to the car. And that's us from the bushes. Family, Bean, uh, Cafe, Museum, Country Store. Uh, we might try and come try the cafe tomorrow before we head back because we're leaving tomorrow afternoon to head home. So, roll that beautiful bean footage. <laughs> we love you guys. Till tomorrow.